I just remember, you know, it hurt the be at first it hurt, you know, physically. It really hurt, but then I got to a point where I couldn't feel anything. I was completely numb. I remember seeing blood and I just remember thinking to myself that I'm dying. This is this is gonna die. A couple of hours afterwards had my fear went to numb and then I went from numb to that's never happened to me ever again. No one's ever going to do me like that. And I think that, you know, a part of me, a part of me did die that day. For a period of time, we were out of the house. My sister and I, we were in foster care for a very brief time. The system worked on our behalf, I will say. Uh, as a community, as a uh, profession, it worked on our behalf. Uh, I, but I, I know I've seen um, other circumstances where the system completely failed. Uh, and so I consider myself blessed. There's been a lot of healing since then. Came up in a conversation with my wife. She has done a lot of deep healing um, in her own journey. And we sat down and we were talking. Uh, there was a, a, a secret that I was keeping to myself about self-harm, about suicide. And it's just crazy how things can be so wonderful on the outside. And then you have, I have these moments where I just don't want to be here. And I carried this by my, uh, to myself for a very long time. She asked me, how old is this? And, and I just went right back to when I was eight years old. And I went numb. She asked me, she's like, so what would you tell eight-year-old Rob today? You're going to live. Not only are you going to live, you're going to live well. And then boom, everything opened up. The container expanded. Um, I've been able to, to receive more. I'm able to give more. So if you're hurting, you know, there's there, healing is possible. Not only is healing possible, but you can become a very productive member of society. I, I never would have thought that I would be in a place where I'd be a deputy director of a nonprofit organization um, dealing with people who've gone through the similar things that I've gone through. So yeah, I'm not 100% healed, but still I, I suit up and show up every day and I'm very effective at what I do and I'm very proud of that. And it's not over and I'm looking forward to seeing what's next.